Shopping Seller. Welcome to the new Seller Beginner Class. I'll be your trainer, me. Hello, Shopee Sellers! So our topic for today is Marketing Center and its relationship with Business Insight. Okay? So let's focus on Marketing Center for this video. So ano ba yung Marketing Center? So pag si seller magbibenta ng product sa Shopee, what's the best way for you to promote the product? So dito makikita sa Marketing Center yan. This is where you can actually create promotions, discounts yung mga yun, and you can actually engage with your shoppers through the Marketing Center. So all you need to do to go to Marketing Center is to go to your Seller Center via desktop. Uh, it, for this occasion guys, mas better talaga mag-use ng desktop if you want to access the full features of your marketing center. But you can also use the app version. So once you are at Seller Center, you need to look for marketing tools or marketing center. And then from that point, makikita nyo yung breakdown ng offers namin in terms of the marketing center. The very first thing you will see is our campaigns and our upcoming campaigns. So dito makikita yung mga 9, 9, 10, 10, our numerical campaigns, lifestyle week, Fashion Week, those kinds of uh, campaigns that we create on a weekly basis. And of course, nandito rin yung mga Shopee Flash Deal. Now, for these campaigns, for a seller to join these campaigns, you need to be either a mall seller for the platform or you can be a managed seller. But if you are a new seller or rather a marketplace seller, uh, it's actually uh, restricted. So, the very first thing I'll discuss in terms of the marketing tools are the many... Uh, basic things that you can try to play with or to try to add to your uh, products. So I will be discussing vouchers, discount promotions, and of course your follow price. These are the most effective ways for you to promote your product if you're actually a new seller in the platform. If you want to learn more about uh, the advanced ways of utilizing marketing tools, it's in the Seller Education Hub in our intermediate course. So. What is discount promotion? So if ever you're going to buy an item sa Shopee, if you've ever bought an item, yung mapapansin kayo yung mga products na may 30% off here or 40% off, that is what we call a discount promotion. So these are products na bawas yung presyo niya. So seller is shouldering the discount. So seller sponsored discount siya. You're going to set an item and then from that base price, you're gonna create a marketing tool called the discount and then from that point, mababawasan yung price niya if a buyer will purchase it. So in order for you to create a discount promotion, you simply have to click my discounts and then click new discount promotion. After that, it will tell you, uh, it will ask a promotion name. So, yung promotion name, it's just for uh, the perspective ni seller. It doesn't have to be that uh, important kasi uh, it's only for seller's reference para lang maalala nyo kung ano yung campaign na yan. And then, a promotion period, which is very important. You have to input the details of the promotion name and time period. Hindi na pwede extend yung promotion period, so you have to be careful with what type or the length of the promotion period that you're going to create. Now, after that, you click save and continue. And then you can now add products that you would like to create a discount with. So once you have added your products, mamimili ka na ngayon or you're going to set the discount of each product that you plan on selling. And then once you are done with the edits or once you have created the discounts for each item, you simply click done. And then gagana na yung voucher na yun, or rather yung discount na yun. So the next one naman that I will be discussing is called vouchers. Now vouchers are in a way the same concept as discounts but for them to be able to use this type of discount, kailangan si buyer alam ko ano yung voucher nyo or voucher code. It's a unique set of letters or numbers that the, that the seller will create. Tapos pag ginamit siya ni buyer, they can redeem either a percentage of or a price na babawasan dun sa product nila. So we have two types of vouchers that you can create. You can actually create a shop voucher or a product voucher. So the shop voucher can be used for all the products that you offer in the shop. And then a product voucher is just for a selected item and or a set of items. So it gives you flexibility naman uh, to choose kung ano yung gusto niyo yung type of voucher. So it can be a discount or a coin cashback, uh, the value of the voucher, uh, ilan ba yung gusto niyo i-release na vouchers, and then the duration as well. You can also edit that. And then the specific products the voucher can be applied to. Kagagamit kayo ng product voucher. So it can be located in a marketing center right near discount promotions. And then all you need to do is to go to vouchers and then click create new voucher. Mamimili ka kung shop voucher or product voucher. Uh, for this example, let's use a, a shop voucher. And then you type the voucher name. 
which is irrelevant. Uh, perspective lang ulit to ni uh, seller for the seller's eyes only. The important thing is the voucher code. So this is actually the code that they need in order for them to redeem the voucher code that you're going to create. And then the reward type. Is it gonna be a coins cashback or a discount? And then a discount type amount. Is it a percentage or a fixed amount? Kayo po bahala. And then a minimum basket price. So a minimum basket price is how much do they need to spend in your store for them to use this voucher code. So that's the way uh, sellers can actually uh, earn or uh, get profit from utilizing discounts like this. So you can create the voucher start date and edit which you cannot edit. Uh, when you say you cannot edit, hindi mo siya pwede extend and then voucher quantity. Ilan yung willing kang release na voucher code. So, the only time a voucher code will spend is if they were able to check out an order using the voucher code that you are using. So, set up your voucher display page. So, by the way, your vouchers will actually be promoted through the platform via your account. So, they can be showcased in your homepage your product detail page and of course to entice them your shopping cart page as well they can actually click and redeem the code Ayan. so mamimili ka na lang kung applicable products na gusto mo ilagay sa shop homepage mo product detail and your shipping cart and then once you're done you click save Ayan. so they will appear like this as you can see on the example all they need to do is claim the voucher and then they can save it in their account Ayan. so if ever they were able to save a uh, save the voucher in your account kapag naubos na yung voucher quantity they can no longer redeem that code okay so the next one is follow price so this is actually one of the most effective ways for you to get new followers in shopee so if you're a new account in the platform it's actually ideal na marami kang followers because if you have a lot of followers every time you upload new content or new products lumalabas siya sa um, Dumalabas siya sa mga followers mo. They're, get the, uh, they're given push notifications. So, you can actually entice buyers to follow your account by utilizing this thing that we call follow price. So, it's an incentive. Kapag finalo mo yung account ko, I will actually provide a reward. So, uh, ito po yung qualifications for a buyer to, be uh, to receive a follower price. Uh, the buyer must not be a follower before the event of your follow price and then they have never claimed a follow price from your shop before and then lastly they have to enter and follow the shop during the event period so in order to locate the follow price it is part of marketing center you simply click follow price create a follow price and then from that point meron tayong follow price name not public siya so a perspective lang ulit ni seller tapos yung start date and end date mo so start time can be from today at the end of the time must be more than one day after start time so kailangan talaga maglap siya ng one day and then the follow price time so currently voucher lang po yung available when it comes to the follow uh, price that we have voucher siya and then the, re uh, the reward type can be chosen as either a discount or a coins cashback so it's the same concept as a voucher that uh, i previously explained and then you can set a maximum discount price can be set if you're given percentage discount so make cap siya, minimum basket size and then a follow price quantity so ilan lang yung pwedeng mag follow sa to get a follow price thank you